Howdy, it's Tubal Cain, also known as Mr. Pete 222, and it's July of the year 2015, and in our local newspaper here, there have been many articles lately about uh, Pluto and uh, Dr. Clyde Tombaugh, the discoverer of uh, Pluto, who is a native of Streeter, and uh, after all these years, uh, the, uh, uh, the flyby is here. And there's been a lot of uh, information in the paper lately about this, different articles, and I'm sure in national papers as well. And uh, we even had a big celebration in here, here in Streeter, about Pluto. But this is a, a little bit different video than what I usually make. I normally have shop videos, and there's 500 of them. But I took a little trip around town and did some research and went to the Streeterland Historical Society and gathered some information. So take a look at the things that I found about our local hero, Clyde Tombaugh, discoverer of Pluto, as well as many asteroids. Look him up on Wikipedia for more information. I'm currently standing in front of the Streeter City Hall with the camera on this plaque that has been here for many years, since 1985 and is in remembrance of Clyde William Tombaugh, who was born and raised here in Streeter, Illinois. So pause your video to read this. I'm in downtown Streeter in the business district, and this is a mural that is uh, above a furniture store down here in recognition of our local hero, Clyde Tombaugh. Howdy, it's Tubal Cain, and I'm on the lower level of the Streeterland Historical Society here in downtown Streeter. And uh, I'm doing research on Clyde Tombaugh, a native of Streeter, and you know who he is or you wouldn't be watching this. And they have one entire corner here devoted to this man and his works and uh, various books and pictures and so on. And uh, I just want to show you a few of those things. And to start with here, there is an old telescope. And it says here, below the tripod, that uh, this tripod belonged to Leon Tombaugh. Leon was Clyde's uncle, and it was he who first aroused Clyde's interest in astronomy. The tripod and a telescope similar to this one were used by Leon and his nephew Clyde to view the heavens when Clyde was a boy. So that's pretty awesome. And here's a, a, a painting of him. Of course, these discoveries were made out west, not here in Streeter, where the sky is much clearer. You can pause your video to read some of this. And there are books about Clyde here. Clyde Tombaugh, discoverer of the planet Pluto by David Levi. Here's a collage of articles from newspapers and magazines about Clyde and what he did. I know you're not going to be able to read this, but uh, there's been over the years many articles in our local paper about him. And there he is as an older man, like me. There's a picture of Clyde, framed, and here he is as a much younger man. He was born the same year as my father. And that appears to be Clyde there as a boy. Here are some older pictures. There's Clyde on his bicycle ready to go to high school. His school there at Heenanville, that was near Streeter. And there he is with the nine inch telescope. Here's an old picture and that's Clyde right there sitting on the running board and you can see that he already 
had a curious nature because he couldn't concentrate on the camera. He's looking around. I think that's a Model T touring car, but you can correct me if it isn't. This is a handwritten letter by Clyde Tombaugh. And you can see the stationery that it's on. New Mexico State University in 1985. And this apparently is Clyde thanking the Historical Society for putting the marker, and I believe it's the one in front of City Hall that I showed at the beginning of this video. And he attended Streeter High School for two years before they moved, uh, and that's where I taught school for over 40 years. And of course, it's signed by Clyde Tombaugh. Now, where else are you going to see that? This is a portfolio of pictures and articles and information about Clyde Tombaugh here at the Historical Society. Pluto Pride. There's a young Clyde. And a very distinguished looking Clyde in 1962. And some more letters written and signed by Clyde. And in fact, there's a whole He's a member of the Explorers Club. That's 1980. And if anyone is interested in this, they can come to the Historical Society here and, uh, and read and study this information. Also here at the Historical Society are two rather thick folders, file folders, with articles and reprints and so on about the times and life of uh, Tom, uh, Mr. Tombaugh, Dr. Tombaugh, more than I can include in this short video and uh, that uh, we'll have to be conclude this video right now and I hope you enjoyed this and, and tell your friends about it if you're interested in uh, Pluto and the discoverer of Pluto. This is Tubal Cain saying so long for now.